So ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back once again to the greatest watch market update show in the world. As you know, me and Kino, me and Sweet Kid Kino will always tell you the truth on what's happening in the Muppet Boiler Room. What those Muppets won't dare to tell you, me and Sweet Kid Kino will tell you the truth. And you know why we'll tell you the truth? Because me and Sweet Kid Kino are stupid like that. That's why. That's why we're always going to tell you the truth. What these Muppet Boiler Room secondary great watch market channels won't tell you, me and Kino will always tell you what's happening out there. And today, my manager, my manager, the brains behind this channel, has something prepared for you, gentlemen out there, that love the Rolex GMT watch models. We're gonna be talking about the Rolex GMT models today. My manager, which is the brains of this channel, and I am the voice of this channel, has this prepared for you gentlemen out there that love the GMT watch models. Unbelievable, but true, unbelievable. You know, unbelievable. We're gonna be talking about no other than the Rolex GMT Bruce Wayne. You know, the one that just came out like around three months, four months ago, I don't know when it came out, I think it was somewhere in April it came out. We're gonna be talking about that watch. Unbelievable. But before I get into all that, let's go into my magical intro. Sweet kid, that Kino, sweet kid. So ladies and gentlemen, I'm back with this information on the Rolex GMT stainless steel Bruce Wayne. Well, we're gonna be talking about the Rolex GMT models, you know, unbelievable. But as you know, this watch, this Rolex GMT Bruce Wayne was introduced sometime in April of 2024. That's right. Unbelievable looking time machine, as you can see in the picture. And when this watch was first released, it was over $35,000 in the Muppet Boiler Room secondary great watch market. Unbelievable, but true. But I don't know if many of you know this. This watch, this watch is specifically because this was the best that Rolex could do out of their 2024 batch of new releases. This is the best they had, the Bruce Wayne. Unbelievable looking time machine, unbelievable. Stainless steel with a black and gray ceramic bezel with a black dial. And it comes in a Jubilee bracelet and also in an Oyster bracelet. And like I'm telling you, on this 2024 release, this was the best that Rolex can do. This was the best they can do, this Bruce Wayne. But ladies and gentlemen, as you know, this watch has a, a retail price of $10,700. Unbelievable looking time machine, unbelievable. You know, the reference number of this watch is the 126710GRNR. Unbelievable looking time machine. But there's a problem, folks. This watch, this watch model was awarded to every Muppet Boiler Room secondary gray watch market dealer out there by no other than all the Rolex authorized dealers out there. That's right. They were the ones that were awarded this watch. Not you or not me. They were awarded that watch, you know, by their favorite AD, by their favorite Rolex authorized dealer. Unbelievable, but true. You know, we can never get it. Me, I'm still trying to get one. You know, I'm still trying to get one, but they haven't called me and I'm never going to pay the Muppet Boy the Room secondary great watch market channels and dealers price. Never, I'm never gonna pay for it. And like I said, that watch was over 35, then 28, then 24, 22. I'm gonna tell you what you should pay later on. Be patient, I'm gonna be patient. But this watch has been awarded to the Muppet Boy the Room channels, that's right. With a hefty grease up price of four thousand dollars in other words you know the ad will give this watch to the to the muppet boy the room channels they would give it to them with a price tag of four thousand dollars on top of the ten thousand seven hundred dollars that's the retail price of that watch plus their taxes if they're in the states if they're in the caribbean you don't pay no taxes but in the states ten thousand ten thousand seven hundred dollars plus your taxes and the 4,000 grease up money you had to pay them through the back door. Because these 
authorized Rolex dealers sell to the Muppet channels through the back door. Unbelievable, through the back door. Don't forget that. Your favorite Rolex authorized dealer sells watches the back door way. And all these Muppet dealers were awarded that Bruce Wayne watch for $4,000. You grease them up and you get the watch. Unbelievable. So let's say that watch between the 10,700 retail and the 4,000 grease up money to the uh, Rolex authorized dealer plus your taxes. Let's round it up to you know, $15,000, right? 15,500. $15,500 off the gate that watch is costing, okay? Keep that in mind. But Sweet Kino has prepared something for me. There, there are some other beautiful Rolex stainless steel GMT watches that you guys should be looking at. Like the number one watch you should be looking at is the original Rolex stainless steel with a black and blue black dial Batman with an oyster bracelet. Look, take a look at the, at the picture of this watch. Unbelievable looking time machine. This has a price tag of $10,700, this watch. The original Batman, $10,700. And the reference number of this beautiful watch is the 126710BLNR. Unbelievable. And ladies and gentlemen, you can get that original Batman with the black and blue ceramic bezel with the black dial. I mean, you can get that watch between thirteen dollars and $14,000 in dropping. Unbelievable. You know, I mean, I'm telling you, this watch has more fun than that Bruce Wayne with the black and gray ceramic bezel. That's more fun. Uh, that, that blue and black ceramic bezel is much more fun. And you also have the Batgirl, the stainless steel Batgirl with a Jubilee bracelet with a black and blue ceramic bezel and a black dial. You know, you have the oyster bracelet and you have the Jubilee bracelet. Unbelievable. Take a look at the picture of that watch. Unbelievable. Unbelievable looking time machine. And that watch is also $10,700. And you can get that watch out there between $14,500 and $15,000. That's right. So, you know, before you're looking at that Bruce Wayne, you know, with the black and gray ceramic bezel, take a look at the Batman. Your money's a little bit better. Maybe I'm doing a favor talking about these watches. Maybe I'm helping out the Muppet Boy to Room secondary gray watch market with those prices. But this is what it is, you know, this is what it is. You know, at this moment, you can get that uh, Oyster Batman stainless steel. Mm, I don't know. I traded the price already, you know. I don't know, thirteen, five, fourteen thousand dollars $14,000, and you can get the uh, the Jubilee one for fourteen, fourteen, five, fifteen thousand dollars $15,000. That's right. And also, you have also the Pepsi. Unbelievable looking watch, the Pepsi. Unbelievable. Take a look-see at the picture of the Pepsi. You have the Pepsi. That is an unbelievable looking watch. The reference number of the Pepsi is the 126710BLRO. It has a retail price of $10,700. That's right. And this watch at one moment was over, over $25,000. That's right. And I'm going to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, take a look at the Pepsi too. It's a lot of fun, you know? It's unbelievable that that beautiful red and blue ceramic bezel. It's, it's unbelievable. Uh, you know, it's unbelievable. Beautiful looking time machine. Beautiful looking time machine. And the retail price is also $10,700. And I'm going to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, you can get that watch out there in the Muppet Boy, the room secondary gray watch market dealers. You can get it out there for somewhere between, you know, $18,000 and $18,500 and dropping. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Also, there's another one too, which is the left hand. You know, some of you call it the Sprite. I call it the Heineken. You know, it's unbelievable looking with time machine. Unbelievable, this Heineken. You know, the one you guys call the Sprite, I call it the Heineken. Take a look at the picture of this Heineken. It's an unbelievable looking time machine. As you can see, this is the left hand. And the reference number of this watch is the 126720VTNR. It has a retail price of 11000 $250. That's right. That's right. You know, this is, has a Jubilee bracelet. This is an unbelievable watch. When this watch was first released, it was over, over $50,000.
and people were going bananas for this watch. But at this moment, this watch is dead. This watch is dead. And I'm gonna tell you, ladies and gentlemen, you can pay in the Muppet Boy to Room secondary gray watch market between, for the, for the Oyster bracelet and the Jubilee bracelet between Fifteen and fifteen thousand five hundred dollars and drop it. Unbelievable! Unbelievable! And I'm showing you all these GMTs and stainless steel, so you can compare apples to apples, you know, or oranges to oranges. You have the California orange and you have the Florida orange. And at this moment, the Florida orange has much more juice than the California orange. Unbelievable, but true. The, 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 the Florida orange is not the most prettiest orange in the world. It, it ain't as pretty as the California orange. But the one that has the more juice is the Florida orange. Keep that in mind always, okay? All right? Keep that in mind. So anyway, so I'm telling you about these Rolex GMT models. You know, before paying that $25,000, $22,000, $28,000, $35,000 for that Bruce Wayne, take a look-see at these models that I just finished telling you, these stainless steel models, you know, the Batman, you know, the Pepsi, the Sprite, Heineken, I call it the Heineken, you call it the Sprite. And also, you also have the two-tone. You also have the two-tone Bruce Wayne, stainless steel with yellow gold. Take a look at the picture of this watch. It's an unbelievable looking time machine. Unbelievable looking time machine. You know, it's unbelievable. The reference number of that watch is the 126713GRNR. It has a retail price of $16,450. And ladies and gentlemen, you can buy this watch in the Muppet Boy to Room secondary gray watch market for no more, for no less than $17,000. Okay, $17,500 as well too. You know, $17,000, $17,500, you can buy that watch. Unbelievable looking time machine exit. As you guys see in the picture, unbelievable, unbelievable. Also, you have the most beautiful GMT two-tone with the rose gold. Take a look at the picture. That watch is an unbelievable looking time machine. They call this watch the root beer, and I believe the name goes quite well with this watch. This is an unbelievable looking time machine, as you can see in the picture. Unbelievable. This is the Rolex GMT Master Two root beer, rose gold. Reference number of this watch is the 126711CHNR. It has a retail price of $16,750. That's right. And it comes in an oyster bracelet. Oyster bracelet, as you can see in the picture. And I'm going to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, you can buy this watch as well in the Muppet Boiler Room Secondary Great Watch Market for $16,500. And unbelievable. Unbelievable. But ladies and gentlemen, I'm keeping the best watch for the end. This watch that I'm going to show you now is another Rolex. GMT. Stainless steel with a black ceramic bezel. Black dial with a GMT green hand. Unbelievable. And your favorite word to hear, and you guys get excited because you guys like to get flim flam and fleece by these footballs. That's right. We're talking about, take a look at the picture of this watch. Are you looking at it? This is an unbelievable looking Rolex GMT stainless steel with a black ceramic and black dial. The reference number of this beautiful, beautiful GMT, it is the 116710. It has a retail price of $8,450. And like I told you, this watch was discontinued. If I put this watch next to the Bruce Wayne, man, you don't see no difference whatsoever. What you probably see is, you know, the black and gray ceramic bezel, you know, and you probably have a better, you know, power reserve. Maybe the, the movement on the Bruce Wayne has been tweaked a little bit more, but I just finished telling you, you can get this Rolex GMT, black ceramic bezel, black dial that has been discontinued, discontinued. You know, the word discontinued is for lollipop suckers and window lickers. Discontinued mean nothing. 
This watch, when it gets discontinued, is going to go up to $25,000. Well, ladies and gentlemen, you can buy this beautiful watch, as you can see in the picture. As you can see in the picture, you can buy this watch between $10,500 and $11,500. That's right. And I'm telling you all this about the Rolex GMT watch models because you need to know this. You need to know that you can look at these other watches. All these watches are dropping in prices that I just finished telling you. The Batman, the Batgirl, the Pepsi, the Sprite, Heineken, the Root Beer, the Bruce Wayne Two-Tone. They're all dropping in prices because the watch market is dead. And I'm going to compare again to you that Rolex GMT black ceramic bezel, black dial stainless steel with an oyster bracelet with the GMT green hand, with the Bruce Wayne that just came out, that they're asking that amount of money for it. I'm going to have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, to all these Muppet Boiler Room secondary gray watch market dealers that pay to grease up the Rolex authorized dealer to give them that watch and not to me or you, I'm going to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, don't pay for that Rolex GMT Bruce Wayne with a Jubilee bracelet. Don't pay more, and I mean don't pay more than $16,000 in drop. You heard that right. Did you hear me? Don't pay for that Rolex GMT Bruce Wayne with a Jubilee bracelet. Don't pay more than $16,000 in dropping. All right? So this message is to all those Muppet Boiler Room secondary great watch market dealers that greased up their Rolex authorized dealers to get their, their hands and get awarded that watch. That's what the watch right now, you should pay for that watch. No more than $16,000. That Bruce Wayne is dropping by the day. That Bruce Wayne watch, you know, that just came out in April, 2024, with the black and gray ceramic bezel, is dropping by the day. And I'm giving you a head start. Don't pay for that Bruce Wayne more than $16,000. Unbelievable. And you know what I'm thinking you should pay for the oyster bracelet. Don't pay more than $15,000. Unbelievable, but true. The watch market is dead. You got to stop maintaining these flim flammers that have fleeced you for so long. You cannot continue maintaining their red go fast car, their sushi dinners, their steak dinners, their red Louis Vuitton Nike sneakers, their ripped jeans. You can't do that no more. Their Supreme hoodies, their Montclair sweaters. You cannot continue doing that. The watch market is dead. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I'm sorry to tell you the watch market is dead. No matter what they keep on telling you, that the watch market is up and running, the watch market is dead. Stop being lollipop suckers. Stop being window lickers. Stop being tomato cans. Stop being crayon eaters. The watch market is dead. I know what I'm telling you. I said it wrong. I know what sweet kid Keno was always telling me. He tells me the truth. Keno is the brains behind this channel and I am the voice. And whatever he tells me is what I say. And he just finished telling me that. Those watches are dropping faster than Bill Clinton's pants in an Arkansas farmhouse. That's right. That Bruce Wayne is dropping faster than Billy Boy's pants in an Arkansas farmhouse. Unbelievable. The watch market is dead in a backyard pool and floating face down like this. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. The watch market is dead. So there it is. If you're looking to buy, to purchase, a Rolex stainless steel GMT or a Rolex two-tone GMT, take a look at those watches before you give up your money on that new Rolex stainless steel Bruce Wayne with a black and gray ceramic bezel. I know what I'm telling you, ladies and gentlemen. The watch market is dead. 
These prices are dropping every single day. They are desperate out there. You know what your job is to do? Not to buy for them, let them suffer. You know all the money they pay to all those Rolex authorized dealers? You know, they had to grease them up. You know, grease them up. They had to grease them up with green dollar bills so they can get those watches. Let them hold on to it. Let them keep on holding on to it. Let them keep on dropping and dropping and dropping and dropping. You're going to get your watches. Be patient. You see me? I haven't still got my Bruce Wayne. I'm going to get it. Don't worry about it. I'm going to get it. Listen, if there's a Rolex authorized dealer out there that wants to give a real watch collector a Bruce Wayne with a Jubilee bracelet or an Oyster bracelet, please call me. I will be making an unbelievable video on your authorized Rolex store. That's right. I'll make it simple for you. Uh, I'll make an ad on you for the whole year, for one whole year, to show everybody that there's one truthful authorized Rolex dealer out there. If you're looking to give a real Rolex to a real watch collector, I'm your man right here. I'm your man. You know? I, I, I'll go pick it up wherever you have that. But this video was done because all Rolex authorized dealers awarded the Muppet Boiler Room secondary great watch market dealers this Bruce Wayne. And there are so many of those watches out in the street right now, they don't know what to do with it. They don't know what to do. There are too, too many of the Bruce Wayne GMT black and gray ceramic bezel with a black dial, with a Jubilee bracelet, a oyster bracelet out there. All right? There's tons, tons of those watches. And they're dropping by the day. All right? So stop being window lickers. Stop being lollipop suckers. The watch market is dead. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I really hope you enjoy this watch market update on Rolex GMT models that are dropping by the day. It's specifically that Rolex GMT Bruce Wayne with the Jubilee band or the Oyster bracelet. Use this to your advantage to defend yourself from these flim flammers. They have fleeced you for too long until sweet Kit Kino and I came along. Well, ladies and gentlemen, like I say every week, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like my video. And like we always say as well, take care and brush your hair.